Did you know that Kansas City, despite being Missouri's largest city and significantly larger in area than Chicago, Illinois, by almost 100 square miles, has a much smaller population? While Chicago boasts approximately 2.6 million residents, Kansas City has only about 510,000. This stark difference results in a population density of around 11,400 people per square mile in Chicago, making it over seven times denser than Kansas City, which has a density of roughly 1,600 people per square mile. However, Kansas City isn't an isolated case. Many large, well-known American cities share this surprising emptiness. In this episode of Journey Gemstone, we're diving into the reasons behind the low population density in these 10 massive yet underpopulated cities. For comparison, let's consider the United States' most densely populated metropolises, such as New York City, San Francisco, and Boston. These cities cover total land areas of 3.4, 46.9, and 48.3 square miles respectively, with astonishing population densities of about 27,000, 177,000, and 13,000 people per square mile, highlighting the significant variance in urban population distribution. Tucson, Arizona, lands at number 10 on our list of large yet surprisingly empty cities. With a unique blend of cultural heritage and natural beauty, it might come as a surprise that this city doesn't boast a higher population. Tucson has a population of around 542,000 people. But despite its size and the amenities it offers, it hasn't seen the population booms that other cities have experienced. Several factors contribute to Tucson's relatively low population density. Firstly, the city is surrounded by vast expanses of desert and protected parklands, limiting expansive urban sprawl. Additionally, Tucson faces economic challenges, including lower median household incomes, and a job market that's not as robust as those in more densely populated cities. This economic situation may deter people from moving to or staying in Tucson. Moreover, the city's higher education and technology sectors, while significant, have not grown at the pace seen in other tech hubs, which could have otherwise attracted a larger workforce. Despite its beauty and rich cultural scene, these factors combined may help explain why Tucson remains on the list of big, yet less populated cities. New Orleans, Louisiana, occupies the ninth spot on our exploration of large cities that are surprisingly empty. Known for its vibrant culture, rich history, and iconic celebrations like Mardi Gras, New Orleans has a population of about 383,000 people. This number is notably lower than one might expect for such a culturally significant city. The reasons behind New Orleans' lower population density are multifaceted. The city has faced significant challenges over the years including the devastating impact of Hurricane Katrina in 2005, which led to a massive displacement of residents. Many people left and never returned, significantly affecting the city's population. Furthermore, New Orleans struggles with issues such as high crime rates, economic disparities, and environmental vulnerabilities, which can deter people from moving to or staying in the city. Despite these challenges, New Orleans remains a city with a strong sense of community and cultural richness. Its lower population density does not diminish its importance or the vibrancy of life there, but it does place it among the larger, yet less densely populated cities in the United States. For more content like this, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to stay updated on our latest posts. Memphis, Tennessee claims the eighth position on our list, highlighting large cities with surprisingly low populations. Memphis is a city with deep roots in American music history, known as the birthplace of blues, soul and rock and roll, and home to iconic attractions like Graceland and Beale Street. Despite its cultural significance and historical richness, Memphis has a population of approximately 633,000 people, which is modest for a city of its stature and amenities. The reasons behind this relatively low population density are complex. Economic factors play a significant role, as Memphis grapples with higher poverty rates and lower median household incomes compared to more densely populated urban areas. This economic reality can make it challenging for the city to attract and retain residents. Additionally, Memphis faces social challenges, including crime rates that are higher than the national average, which can affect perceptions of safety and quality of life. 
While the city boasts a strong cultural scene and a significant historical legacy, these socio-economic issues contribute to its position as a larger city with fewer residents than one might expect. Tulsa, Oklahoma, distinguished for its historical significance in the oil industry, art deco treasures, and a thriving cultural life, finds itself at number seven among large cities that surprisingly have low population densities. With a population that hovers around 402,000, Tulsa presents a curious case of a city that, despite its potential for economic prosperity and cultural richness, doesn't attract or retain as large a population as one might expect. The city's economic landscape has been profoundly shaped by the oil sector, which, while lucrative, has experienced significant volatility over the years, affecting job stability and growth opportunities. This economic unpredictability, coupled with challenges in education and higher crime rates compared to denser urban areas, might deter individuals and families from settling in Tulsa. Nevertheless, the city boasts commendable efforts towards revitalization, a burgeoning small business ecosystem, and a vibrant community life, underscored by its parks, museums, and cultural events. Tulsa's position on this list underscores the nuanced balance between its inherent attractions and the socio-economic challenges it faces, painting a picture of a city with much to offer, yet still grappling with complexities that affect its population density. Virginia Beach, Virginia, renowned for its picturesque beaches, vibrant boardwalk, and a climate that draws visitors year-round, surprisingly finds itself at number six on the list of large cities with unexpectedly low population densities. Despite its allure as a prime coastal destination, Virginia Beach's population stands at approximately 450,000 days, a figure that might seem modest for a city offering an enviable mix of natural beauty, recreational opportunities, and a high quality of life. This disparity between the city's appeal and its population size can be attributed to a complex interplay of geographic, economic, and policy-related factors. Geographically, Virginia Beach is characterized by its extensive coastline, which, while a major draw for tourism and leisure, also imposes natural constraints on urban development. Significant portions of the city's land are dedicated to preserving the coastal environment, military bases that are crucial to the national defense infrastructure, and areas designated for agricultural purposes. These land use priorities, while enhancing the city's appeal and strategic importance, limit the availability of land for residential expansion, indirectly influencing population density. Furthermore, Policy decisions related to land use and development reflect a deliberate approach to balance growth with environmental preservation and quality of life. This approach ensures that while Virginia Beach remains a highly desirable place to live, work, and visit, it does not follow the trajectory of rapid urban sprawl seen in other cities. Despite these challenges, Virginia Beach continues to attract residents who value its community-oriented lifestyle, excellent educational institutions, and the myriad of outdoor and cultural activities it offers. Kansas City, Missouri, claims the fifth spot on our list, standing out for its expansive size and unexpectedly low population density. With a sprawling urban landscape that encompasses about 319 square miles, it's surprising to find that Kansas City houses only around 510,000 residents. This contrast is particularly striking when considering the city's rich cultural offerings, including a vibrant jazz heritage, numerous museums, and a renowned barbecue scene. Several factors contribute to Kansas City's modest population density. The city's extensive geographical area allows for a more spread-out population, unlike cities where geographical constraints force a denser living situation. Furthermore, while Kansas City boasts significant cultural and economic attractions, it also faces challenges such as economic disparities and areas of urban blight, which can deter potential residents. Despite these challenges, Kansas City's low cost of living, combined with its cultural richness and strong sense of community, continues to make it an attractive place to live. However, its large size and the distribution of its population contribute to its position as a large, yet not densely populated, urban center. If you enjoyed this content and want to see more, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications to never miss an update. Nashville, Tennessee, famed as the heart of country music and a hub of artistic creativity, lands at number four on our list of surprisingly sparsely populated large cities. Despite its global reputation, 
Buoyed by iconic venues like the Grand Ole Opry and the Country Music Hall of Fame, Nashville's population is around 689,000. This figure is modest for a city that serves as a cultural and economic powerhouse in the American South. Nashville's sprawling layout contributes to its lower population density, offering residents a blend of urban convenience and suburban spaciousness. While the city's vibrant music scene, diverse culinary offerings, and strong job market in sectors like healthcare, education, and entertainment attract people from all walks of life. Factors such as rising living costs and housing prices may pose challenges for those looking to move in. Moreover, the city's rapid growth has led to concerns about traffic congestion and infrastructure strain, potentially impacting its ability to sustain a denser population comfortably. Despite these hurdles, Nashville's appeal remains strong, drawing individuals who seek its dynamic culture and economic opportunities, albeit resulting in a large city with a surprisingly low density of residents. Jacksonville, Florida, takes the third spot on our list, highlighting its unique position as a vast city with a relatively low population density, covering an immense area of over 870 square miles, making it the largest city by land area in the contiguous United States. Jacksonville is home to approximately 911,000 residents. This expansive geographic footprint allows for a population distribution that is less dense than might be expected for a city of its economic and cultural significance. Jacksonville's appeal includes its extensive park system, beautiful beaches, and a growing economy with strong sectors in banking, healthcare, and logistics. However, the city's vastness contributes to its lower population density, as residents are spread across a wide area, from urban centers to suburban and rural communities. Additionally, while Jacksonville offers a high quality of life and relatively affordable living costs, challenges such as transportation and infrastructure development have to keep pace with its sprawling nature. Despite these challenges, Jacksonville continues to attract residents with its combination of economic opportunities, recreational amenities, and a warm climate, maintaining its status as a major city with a surprisingly low population density. Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, secures the second place on our exploration of sizable yet sparsely populated cities, showcasing a unique blend of urban and rural qualities within its extensive boundaries. Spanning over 620 square miles, Oklahoma City is one of the largest cities in the United States by land area, yet it houses a population of just around 655,000 people. This wide expanse of land allows for a lower density of residents, providing ample space for suburban development, agricultural lands, and natural reserves within city limits. The city's economic landscape is diversified, with strong sectors in energy, healthcare, and aviation, attracting a steady flow of professionals and families. However, the vastness of Oklahoma City also presents challenges, such as the need for extensive infrastructure and services to connect distant areas, potentially affecting its population density. Despite these challenges, Oklahoma City's low cost of living, combined with its cultural attractions, such as the Oklahoma City National Memorial and Museum and a lively entertainment district, continues to make it an attractive option for those seeking a balance between urban amenities and the spaciousness of suburban living. This juxtaposition of vast land area with a modest population underscores Oklahoma City's unique standing as a large, yet not densely populated, urban center. Anchorage, Alaska, claims the top position on our list as the most surprising large city with a low population density. Despite being the largest city in Alaska, both in terms of area and population, Anchorage's unique geographic and climatic conditions set it apart. Covering an area of over 1,900 square miles, but with a population of just about 291,000 people. The city showcases an incredibly low density compared to its urban counterparts in the lower 48 states. Anchorage's sprawling landscape is bounded by vast wilderness, rugged mountains, and the waters of the Cook Inlet, creating natural barriers to expansion and influencing the city's population distribution. The harsh climate, with long, cold winters, also plays a significant role in shaping the lifestyle and population growth of Anchorage. Despite these factors, Anchorage remains a vibrant community, with a strong economy based on oil, gas, and tourism, offering residents and visitors alike a unique blend of urban amenities against a backdrop of breathtaking natural beauty. The city's low population density is a reflection of its adaptation to the challenging Alaskan environment, emphasizing the balance between human habitation and the preservation of its stunning natural surroundings.